Hi everyone, welcome to Craft Time with Mr. Stottleman. It's time to make your protein bracelet of science. So, let's get started. The first thing that you have done, you should have if you got to this point, is you have all of your beads picked out. Those all correspond with your initials and amino acids. Uh, and the colors should be all laid out on your desk, including your start codon, which is white, and your stop codon, which is black. So, should be something like this to look at. Mine. I have the start, and then this is my name all the way to the stop. Now, I don't have as many as you all have, uh, but you all will have 22, the 20... From your name plus the start and the stop. You also need to get a piece of black elastic cord. This is a roughly 32 to 36 inches in length. We can always make it shorter. It should be plenty long so we can make it shorter when you get done. So I'm going to show you now how to make your bracelet. So here we go. The first thing you're going to do is take the first amino acid, the stop, uh, um, uh, not amino acid, but just the first start codon. And this thing you're going to take on one side of your string, it doesn't really matter which side you use, one side you're going to put the bead in about so far. Take the other side of your string and you're going to place it through the opposite part of that bead. So there you go, just like so. You'll have the two sides of your string hanging out like so. You'll then take these two sides, I like to kind of pinch them right here, and then pull that bead all the way down to the end of your elastic. Right like so. There you go, you've done your first one. Then go back to the top of your string and take the next one. Here's the next one. Go. It doesn't really matter what side you go into, just go into one side a ways and then take the other string and go in the opposite way. So and I go in like that. I will again get them about even with each other, hold these two, pull the bead all the way down till you get to the end. When you get to that end, you can kind of make them look fancy. There you go. Fancy beads. Yeah, look at that. It's coming together nicely. Okay. You will continue this process for the entire length of your beads. Just take the next one in one string. The other string goes in the opposite direction. Get the two strings even and pull the bead down. All right, so go ahead and do that with all of your beads. When you're finished with all of the beads, then you will simply tie a double knot at the end, and we will get this to go around your wrist at just the right uh, size, and you will wear this beautiful, beautiful, Protein bracelet craft of science, and everyone is going to be so just uh, amazed at your creativity and brilliance. Um, so, uh, hope you have fun, and uh, as always, like, comment, and subscribe.